again, YouTubers, on with SpongeBob 101, back here again on the SpongeBob channel with our first of many SpongeBob DVD review videos. All right, so as you can see in the title and of course in the background, we have our first ever U.S. DVD, at least the first one that I ever got. Um, I got this in February 2008, and um, yeah. Um, it was at that time, you know, being able to get a US DVD for me was like too awesome to be true, right? So, um, anyways, uh, before we begin, um, uh, yeah, today I'm recording this on May 1st, 2015, so it's SpongeBob's 16th anniversary. Um, this year we're not gonna be having any, well, specific celebrations or anything except on, um, our social media networks uh, we'll be getting on uh, back on those as well as our SpongeBob Moves and Guide so make sure you check out our Moves and Guide link is in actually all the links are in the description box below so um, we're gonna be starting out uh, we're gonna be celebrating the today with season 5 volume 1 alright so um, and if you haven't noticed we've changed our intro uh, we've also changed our outro so um, yeah do check uh, do stay around till the end of the video um, and um, reasons why we change it well you know we've been using the old one for over two and a half years and you know it's we figured it's time for a change so um, uh, yeah but uh, we'll still be using uh, the mu uh, the music from that one um, on our other channels. So yeah. Anyways, uh, let's just dive right into our DVD review here. So first up, these are the two discs. We have some slim case, uh, two slim cases here, and of course, um, when you get uh, if you purchase the or the sealed version, of course, it's gonna be sealed. Um, you get this uh, back. It actually was in the back of it. But, you know, when you unwrap the string wrap, it just comes off because it's not stuck on. So, um, just give you guys a look here. First, picture mode. And let's take a look. Uh, you can pause and read it uh, at your leisure. Special features, we have three of them. Two Bulbers Trivias and uh, one Friend of Four Shorts. So, in the security thing, we have an ad for uh, more SpongeBob DVDs. So, yep. I have both of these, but I've only unboxed this one so far. I have all of them actually, but I haven't unboxed this one either. Um, next shop, and of course we have the letter, as uh, as was the tradition um, when they released the box sets. You know, it stopped um, when uh, in 2011 when they released season seven. Uh, there wasn't any insert there anymore. All right, so yeah, that is it. Now on to the discs, right? So um, there are two discs, as already stated right there. Um, and first disc, first case at least, we have of course the cover art, and this one, right? So let's open this up. Uh, season five, following one, disc one. We have Squidward on it. Um, yeah, SpongeBob's undies in there. Okay, um, and of course a quick look at the episodes. So out of this disc, my favorite episode is going to be Friend of Foe, and following up closely behind is New Dicks and Crabs a la Mode. Um, I also used to like Waiting and Nightlight and uh, yeah, those two, but you know, it's kind of boring now. So um, overall for the f this disc alone, I give it a 3.5, yeah, around there. Uh, just above average, of course. Uh, but Friend of Four was pretty uh, cool, I think. Yeah, I, I didn't really used to like it, but, you know, come to think of it, it's not bad. Um, this too. This is the art, and on the other side, uh, Spongebob, right? So, this too, Patrick is on the disc art. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure you guys, know, you guys already know, you know, they don't do disc arts anymore. It's just a silver generic uh, display there. So yeah, anyways, um, there is the episode list, and of course we have the Krusty Sponge Bubble Burst Trivia. My favorite episode here is Sing a Song of Patrick, and the Krusty Sponge is second. Um, Bucket Sweet Bucket places third, and um, um, I think that's about it. Slimy Dancing wasn't too bad either. 
But um, I really didn't like Roller Cowards, Money Talks, and Breath of Fresh Squidward. Okay, Roller Cowards is not that bad. But um, Breath of Fresh Squidward was just downright terrible. You know. Uh, season 5 had a couple of those. Season 4 as well. Season 6, um, yep, but Season 7 to cut down of that. So, um, this too, I give it a, um, I give it a 4, just because it is pretty, okay, maybe a 3.5 as well. But, um, even if I give it a 4, overall, I give this DVD, uh, uh, 3.5 out of 5 because well it had some really great episodes and it had some really terrible episodes in my opinion of course so tell us in the comments below what do you think of season 5 volume 1 do you have this box set and uh, if you do um, well do you enjoy it so of course you know now we have um, the complete fifth season and uh, the first hundred episodes so you know um, this uh, is out of print now, so you can't really get it in stores anymore. Um, but yeah, that's the sides. I forgot to show you guys just now. Um, yeah, so what do you think about it? Uh, drop us a comment in the box below if you have any video suggestions. Yeah, um, follow the instructions in the description box below. Make sure to subscribe, like, favorite, comment, etc. Check out our Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter for more SpongeBob goodness. And keep it right here on Ultimate SpongeBob 101. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and we'll be back um the next video i can't really remember what we're gonna be doing in the next video but um it might be game related so yeah stay tuned for that and that's all for this video thank you guys for watching see you guys next time